Okay, guys, have you seen our other videos of Dave and Wally roofing it right? <laughs> in this instance, this is how not to, this is roofing it wrong. So, Dave, foreman of the roofing contract, turned this roof off. Kind of tell everybody what, what we found here. Um, they put their HVAC unit exactly on top of the insulation. And there should be a wood nailer or a sleeper underneath of it. So they went, so when they re-roofed this, somebody decided down the road to install a new unit and they put it right on top of the old roof instead of going down to the roof deck, right? Correct. So in this instance, we got the building owner here, Marty. Um, this is kind of what we found. So not a good situation. Yeah, my uh, tenant is a call center and uh, they've been getting complaints about leaks. And uh, so this kind of explains a lot. So. You know, I've seen this happen in the past. I'm sure you have just what happens here. I mean, if you guys tear off a roof, well, they just cut the insulation around and they just they just insulate up to it. So there's a lot of weight on this unit. Yeah. So over time, if we did that, we could do that, sure. But over time, this, this unit's going to start sagging and sagging. So like Dave said, we're going to come in, we're going to try. It's not going to be any fun. No. we got to dig all that insulation out of there and get some four, from four by fours or some type of sleeper, some wood structure to distribute this load. Yeah. Obviously we can't go down to the deck. Cause now if we cut that, now we're changing all the duct work, we're changing all the insulation, all the supply lines. So that's that's kind of be what we're gonna do here, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna take a little, just add more time to this job. More time. So again, this is just another instance. You never know what you're gonna run into until you start tearing the roof off. 